Nasodrin, a nasal spray containing cyclamen europium extract, has been developed as an innovative, effective treatment for sinonasal conditions. Let us take a few seconds to review the pathophysiology of sinonasal conditions. This is vital for correct management and effective treatment. If we look at these inflamed sinuses and the respiratory mucosa, we will see that the body's main defense system in such situations, the mucociliary system, is unable to move the mucus outwards. The mucosa becomes increasingly edematous and the inflammation gradually blocks mucus outflow. The sinus becomes blocked with secretions that in time will become mucopurulent. the patient will describe an acute rhinosinusitis with symptoms of nasal obstruction or congestion or anterior or posterior rhinorrhea with varying degrees of facial pain or headache or even loss of smell depending on the severity of the rhinosinusitis. See what happens when we spray nasodrin once a day in each nostril. A few seconds after contact with the respiratory mucosa, an abundant secretion is observed from both the goblet cells and the submucous glands in the mucosa. By means of an osmotic process, the secretions will also carry an inflammatory transudate along with them, clearing the mucosa of inflammatory mediators, viral particles and debris that could complicate or perpetuate the lesion. Daily use of nasodrin for up to 10 days is able to cure the condition at source and enable the respiratory mucosa to return to normal within a few days. It is also possible to prevent and even treat serious otitis media by improving ventilation of the eustachian tube and the middle meters. With its draining effect, Nasodrin provides an effective, innovative treatment for rhinosinusitis while preserving sinonasal physiology.